Oh my! George Brett to dead center field, no doubt about that one. Yo, what's going on everybody? In today's video, I'll be bringing to you the new and final boss, Takashi Raleigh Fingers. We're gonna be using him as an opener and uh, we'll take a look at his attributes real quick. But before we do, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Turn those notifications on in the comment section below. Let me know which two Takashi bosses you went with, okay? Lastly, make sure you follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and TikTok. All three links will be in the description below. So give me a follow three platforms. I would highly appreciate if you did. And also make sure you go check out my shorts channel on YouTube, Pitching underscore Rebel Shorts. Go check it out. Hit the subscribe button, it is completely free, okay? All right, let's quit talking. Let's go ahead and look at Takashi Raleigh Finger. All right, so Raleigh 96 overall, of course, like the other Takashi uh, bosses. Relief pitcher, closing pitcher, whatever you want to, whatever you want to call him. Right hand, he's a right-handed pitcher as well. Got a sinker, slider, fork ball, four seam. And uh, his attributes look like this. 35 stamina, so very good stamina for a reliever. 111 hit per nine and 115 K per nine. The hit per nine is pretty damn high, especially for right-handed relievers. He's one of the highest right now. Walk per nine's at 92 and the control's at 93, so at least control 90 velocity and 90 break so good velocity and good break on his pitches sinkers at 94 the sliders at 87 four balls at 79 four seams at 95 pitch control we got 98 on the sinker 94 on the slider four balls at 87 and then the four seams at 94 and then pitch break we got 93 on the sinker 95 on the slider four balls at 87 and 78 on the four seam which is just fine so very good control and very good pitch break on all his pitches especially his main two pitches with our sinker and slider this is a guy that i can foresee in my bullpen for a little while uh, has good hit per nine, especially for right-handed reliever. One of the best right now in the game. So we're going to use him as an opener. Probably not going to be his role. He's probably not going to be an opener. I'd rather have him as a high leverage guy later in the game. But for this game in the video, we're going to go ahead and use him as an opener. So let's get after it. Our opponent's going to be Gut Shot 24. He's going to have Bob Feller on the bump. We got our debut man and opener in Raleigh Fingers on the bump. Let's get after it. I haven't faced Bob Feller yet. Let's see what he's got. And strike three, let's go. Good start for Raleigh, one up, one down. And we do, two up, two down via the strikeout. Raleigh's looking nice. And strike three, let's go, another strikeout. Three up, three down, we strike out the side with Raleigh to start off his debut, love to see it. All right, we got our cap coming up, let's go. That'll do, big. Good That'll pitch, do. good pitch. I don't know what we were doing with our PCI there, but that was a good pitch, right on the black. I think that's good. Yeah, that's gone. All right, no doubt about that one. We take a one nothing lead off Frank's bat. Love to see it. Good bounce back at bat there. Here comes Mr. George Brett. Let's see if he can follow it up. It's ball freaking two. All right, that was a terrible, terrible swing. That's what happens when you miss pitches over the middle. You get, you get dotted. It's just, I don't know. All right, we scored one. That's all I can say is, you know, we scored one, so at least we got on the board, but man, we should have had like three bombs at him. We missed too many pitches over the middle. Yeah, that's not gonna get, that's not gonna get it done, buddy. All right, one up, one down, we'll take it. One pitch, one out too, so we'll take it. Try to bunt against the shift, did not work whatsoever. All right, two pitches, two outs, love to see it. Love to see it out of Raleigh. There it is. All right, let's go hit. Good two innings out of Raleigh. Another one, two, three. We got five, six, seven coming up. We're gonna leave Raleigh one more inning. Even if he comes up to hit this inning, we're gonna leave him one more inning. He's got 35 stamina, he can definitely do it. That's ball four. I mean, that's a pitch we can hit, but damn, we gotta take those pitches, especially on three, two. There we go, good piece right there. That's gonna get out of here. What a swing, what a damn swing. Sneaks over the wall, right off the top of the wall. We take a two nothing lead. Thank goodness we were able to get our PCI on that. Bob Feller, we know what he's gotta throw. We know he throws a lot of balls, let's go. Okay, we stay back. You know what, I could take that. A little bit on top of it, but I could take the fact that we stayed back on that changeup and drove it the other way. A little bit on top, now we just gotta correct our PCI placement consistently, and that's all we gotta do. As long as we can stay back on those pitches, we'll be fine. Great swing. Great swing. Oh. All right, so we get another inning. We're gonna get another inning out of Raleigh. That was a great swing, by the way. Just a little bit, you know, right at him. And strike three, let's go. All right, one up, one down. And we get him looking, strike three. What a beautiful pitch. 5K so far from Raleigh. Let's see if we can end it right here with a 6K against the pitcher. 
And we blow it by him. Raleigh ends up with six Ks and three innings of work. What a freaking debut for him. Now we're gonna go ahead and pinch hit so we can bring in a uh, starter next inning. He was already in yellow. Good outing out of Raleigh. Love to see it in the debut. Why am I doing this so much? I keep missing every pitch by just enough. God, Lee, my placement has been atrocious, except for the two, two bombs. There we go. There we go. I want to stay back on that one, though. All right, we take a 3 nothing lead off our Caps Oppo Taco right there. My goodness. I'm starting to get very, very frustrated with myself. I'm missing so many pitches to hit, but thankfully we're able to stay back on that one and take it off the field. Get through. Let's go. And a baby Franklin. And a boy. Let's see if we get this rally going. Come on. Oh my. George Brett to dead center field. No doubt about that one. We're going to go ahead and take a 5 nothing lead in the bottom of the third. Let's see if this is actually us getting going. Come on, man. <laughs> that got me. That pitch got me. Change him up in the zone. Good pitch. That was ball four. I mean, I'm on it, but it's ball four. Damn it, dude. And we blow it by, let's go. One up, one down. There it is. He might've just missed it, honestly. Two up, two down. Big, big inning is coming. Like our timing is there. You just gotta get better placement. Good swing, by the way. Gotta get out of this inning first, though. If we wanna go hit, gotta get out of this inning. Okay, I should not have gone back to that pitch. He was late the first time, that time wasn't very late. Was perfectly on that. There we go. All right, let's go hit the baseball, come on. We'll get up the two run bomb, we gotta get those two runs right back. Come on, bottom of the fourth, we got six, seven, eight coming up. Get up the middle, he's got Polanco up there, let's go. All right, we start off with the base hit, boy Trouty, two for two on the day. And Cattell Marte just missed it. Just missed it. Wasn't a bad swing. We got a little bit to the left of it. If we're on that, I'm sure that's gone. A little bit above the zone too, but still, just missed it, man. Oh my God, that curve was so freaking slow. That'll do, big. That'll do. All right, well, so much for a good start to the inning. We just keep missing pitches. All right, one up, one down. Good start to the inning. One pitch went out too. Love to see it. Bobby, make a play. Love this. That boy, Bobby, let's go. He tried to beat the shit, but Bobby's got, Bobby's an athlete, that's what he is. Bobby's an athlete. And strike three, there we go. All right, three up, three down, good inning for Bobby. We got the top of the order coming up. Let's see if we can do damage with a one, two, three again like we did last time, and then keep it rolling. I'm like, I feel like I'm right there, but I just keep missing every goddamn pitch. I stayed too far back now. Oh my God. Bro, oh. Okay, we figured it out there. Perfect, perfect, the opposite way. Beautiful swing right there by Georgie, his second bomb of the game. Come on, man, more swings like that. We, I mean, we're, the timing has been there all game. It's just the placement has not. I actually stayed back on it. I don't have terrible PCI placement, but not the best. Oh my God. All right, 6-2, at least we scored another one. 6-2, out of boy, Georgie. You're the only one that can hit, apparently. And we'll see you later. All right, start off with the K, let's go. Let's keep it going. And strike three, there we go. All right, two up, two down, be the strikeout. Let's get it one more, come on. Need a one, two, three inning. I need a shutdown inning here. We put up a run, we gotta hold them down here. And strike three, there we go. All right, let's go ahead, come on. Six to two going to the bottom of the six. We got five, six, seven coming up. I think he probably may bring in a lefty since we got Babe Ruth up. Oh my God, these are all pitches that's, I don't know. I don't know why I keep missing these pitches to hit. Holy shit. The amount of pitches that I have put in play that should have been crushed slash because of my PCI placement is awful. That's good placement. That's not gonna go anywhere, is it? Oh, it's gonna be off the wall, let's go. 
That carried a lot more than I thought it was. I thought it was gonna be a routine line out. Thankfully, we put our PC on that baseball. All right, here comes Mr. Mike Piazza. All right, we're gonna pinch it here. It's gonna be the seventh inning, next inning. All right, probably should've brought Eddie Escobar in that situation, but it is what it is. Let's go, Delgado. That'll do, big. Good pitch, I, just, I did not read that pitch well. Good pitch. That was a tough at bat, I just was not reading. Um, I did not read him, that, I did not read c -Shake well that at bat at all. All right, go fastball for the way, see if we can get him. There it is, blow up by him. All right, one down. And strike three, there we go. All right, two up, two down, that boy D, D Will, come on. Gotta get out of this inning with no runs, no hits allowed. And strike three, all right. We gotta hit the baseball. Gotta get more runs, I don't feel safe for the four run lead, come on. I just can't figure out my PCI placement in this game. It's just one of the, I'm not gonna hit. If I'm gonna get a run, it's gonna be one or two more runs, but we cannot consistently put our PCI on the baseball. It's just simple as that. That's gonna drop, that's a terrible swing. That's gonna be a double too. No, it's not. That was an awful swing, very early. That's terrible. Get over his head. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> he went, I, I, I don't know. I don't know what to say. We're actually on that baseball, but unfortunately it's right at him. There it is. All right, there we go. One down, good start to the inning. There we go. All right, two down. All right, we'll just All right, put him away, come on, man. Let's at least have a redemption inning. If we could just have a redemption inning, it would be beautiful. There we go, had a boy Castellano swinging a drive to left field, no doubt about that one. We take a seven to two lead. Let's see if we can have ourselves a little redemption inning at least. Never mind, we can't have a redemption inning because we're so early on every fucking pitch. Good pitch, I thought that was a strike. I don't know man, I really don't know why this, why I'm hitting so poorly. I'm seeing the ball fine, it's just I'm not getting my PC on the baseball. There we go, out of boy could tell. Perfect, perfect, the opposite way. We're gonna go ahead and take an eight to two lead. We got Mike Piazza coming up. Let's see if we can keep it going. Why am I so early on every freaking pitch outside? All right, we take an eight two lead going into the top of the ninth. A little bit of redemption inning, right? We had two runs in that inning. Still not what we wanted. Still keep missing pitches, still keep doing everything that we should not be doing. Uh, but we get to eight runs, just pathetic performance this game. This game should be, should have been, this game should have been a mercy rule so much earlier, but we missed so many fucking pitches. Okay, one up, one down, good start to the inning. See if we can put it away with Britton. Why would I throw that pitch? He was sitting on that. Why would I throw that? Great pitch, right down the middle, absolutely love it. Works out though. Two down. And we blow by him, let's go. Good inning, way to put him away. So we end up winning the ball game eight to three in Raleigh's debut. Obviously Raleigh can't get the win because he was the opener. Bobby Miller gets the win, three innings, two hits, five Ks, two earned runs. George Brett ends up as player of the game, two four with two bombs and three RBI. Craig Thomas is three four with a bomb and RBI. Cattell was two four with a bomb in the double with the RBI, and then Mike Trout was a 2-4 with the bomb in our RBI. Overall, not a good hitting performance. I know we had eight runs with 11 hits, but we should have had a mercy rule way earlier in the ball game. Kept missing way too many pitches to hit, swinging at pitches outside the strike zone, not getting our PC on the ball. Timing was there, that's the one thing I gotta say. Timing was there, PCI placement was not there though. We gotta be better with our PCI placement. But Raleigh will be in our bullpen. He's not gonna be as our, he's not gonna be used as an opener. I'd rather use him in later inning situations, but he will be in our bullpen. He is one of the better right-handed relievers in the game right now and should be in your bullpen. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Turn those notifications on, leave a like on the video and in the comment section below, let me know which boss you went, which two bosses you chose from the program or will be choosing, okay? Lastly, make sure you follow me on Twitch, Twitter and TikTok. All three links will be in the description below. So give me a follow through your platforms. I would highly appreciate if you did. And also make sure you go check out my shorts channel on YouTube, pitching underscore rebel shorts. Go check it out. Hit the subscribe button. It is completely free, okay? Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Love y'all. Peace.